guys, welcome to Snowbreak Containment Zone, and uh, we're here to answer the question if Snowbreak is no longer dying. So, right now, they aren't. <laughs> for now, for now. But, um, just wanna go back a few months, a um, few months since launch, uh, July 20th. Today basically is, uh, no, it's not today, but a few days ago was the sixth month period of the game i was wondering if they would turn it around by the sixth month because um up until after the update for um i think for haru for the five star haru things have been kind of stagnant and it kind of was a bit dragging nothing new really um aside from new characters but again it's not really holding the game together and uh one by one players have been leaving players don't think that the game will last but right now they've done a lot of good things that have redeemed themselves they have redeemed themselves really um but this is just for now which is really right after the katcha update and the other updates so again more or less right now they have hit the spot on all of the things that they are supposed to do also guys we do have some you know we do have player engagement with the devs as well um this is recently or recently happened this happened on january 20 or 19 again depending on your you know on the time zone or where you are but again with this new engagement we have more information we'll talk about this in a while so i'm gonna go back to my previous thought in terms of um how they did it they kind of created new characters characters in the four of tests and katya with a kind of a cultured cultured thing so uh, with you know, it, it it really excited the player base. Some of the players actually came back. Those who have stopped, some new players were actually sniffing around and seeing and like to see what actually is happening or what is exciting, what is the fuss all about, which is definitely the Katcha update. So also they have a new permanent game mode in play, which is Paradoxical Labyrinth also again not perfect at this point um, a lot of tweaks here and there uh, they missed a couple of things uh, which i will not talk about um in this short summary my actually my best guess right now is that will this continue will this wave of new insight new content new 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 line of thinking in terms of the devs on how to create content for the game will this be escalated will this be retained that we will have to know for the next few months up leading up to the one year anniversary on july 2024 okay let's go to the news update this one is a news war courtesy of um snowbreak.gg so thank you guys for this <laughs> Earlier today, this refers to January 20. There was a kind of a developer live stream. Uh, most of these live streams take place uh, with the CN version or CN market. So these are the summary of the stream and the conclusion. Just going to highlight uh, more or less what we have here. Improvements on crossbow. This is regarding the alternate fire, the miss shot. So they still have to repair repair or improve that shot i don't like that shot unique paradoxal um, buffs for katya this is what i mean when they still need to perfect the product um it's weird because katya doesn't have buffs for that game so uh this we will have to look forward to adjustments to enemy spawn rates in that labyrinth as well um adding other types of environmental uh, environments for paradox elaborate but would be a welcome you know improvement continual continuous improvements on character models on top of those done in previous updates right now what i see is the characters are not the same the artwork starting from the first one no not the artwork the design from the first one going to the current one 
is not really does not really make sense it's too different so i think they should optimize <laughs> optimize and probably clean things up okay so that is what my line of thinking is um especially for me the default um the default skins usually don't look much um, especially for the earlier model except for a few though so again we have a special mail from operatives on their birthdays which also include opal vouchers improved controls for crossbow mode which is actually important as well um this one is reopening of global chat after server improvements this is for cn server basically um i'm on global server so and also these are small things that we could hope to see in the future um if you want to see the whole thing guys the whole um news that we're discussing just go to snowbreak.gg you can check out news there on the current updates for snowbreak so these were mentioned but not in the official summary so mail logistics officers will have their art portfolio and profiles redone in order to change them into female um, my opinion here is i think this is great but it's not really important for me i'd rather they 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 um optimize um the operatives themselves no longer touching the logistics so plans to add a bridal and schoolgirl outfit to um it's, it's in high demand so this is not a well, this is not a shock to me because this used to be the theme as well in another game that i played a uh, bridal and schoolgirl outfit so again looking forward to that more developer streams in the future to you know probably get more feedback from the uh players an outfit showcase room Th these are you know small things that may appeal to some may not appeal to some but would be okay but again i would rather have them focus on more content for the game and probably more tweaks in the operatives themselves more more interactions probably in the dorm you know um probably i don't know role playing perhaps if they could have conversations with with different responses i don't know so no current plans for a female adjutant model which i think i like at this point um i don't think they need a female adjutant model um because in terms of um the scenes the cutscenes, it's usually the male model and there are a lot of interactions with him so i don't think that's important at this point the one that i am you know looking forward to are game optimizations new content exciting characters great character designs great outfits uh, because i think that's the winning formula at this point so um the next few updates will be crucial it would be hard to top the current one with it, which is katya it was actually hard to top the haru update um katya will be tough to top again so it will be it will be interesting on what they put out next month which is february after this update um again a lot of players have come back a lot of new players have come in because they're very curious about katya which who wouldn't be curious about her anyway so so excited what they could uh, what they could cook up and more or less this would be again a lot of pressure for the devs to be on their toes as they try to you know make sure that this game's uh, trend moves upward no longer goes down um i'm glad that uh, at the six month they did this and really hoping that this game goes far far long so thank you very much guys again comment in the comment section take care stay safe this is the warden and i'm out of here